But you don't like hospitals, though, do you? Yeah, but you've always gone on about how much you can't stand them. Well, that's strange. Oh, well, it must be my mistake. Yep. But I always thought you hated... Oh, Trevor, I don't like hospitals! And I don't like the smell of disinfectant and, and polish and the way your feet squeak on the floor and people coughing in the middle of the night and waking up at all hours just when you're going to sleep. Woman! I hate hospitals! <laughs> Hundreds of people have done this thing you've got. Millions of women all over the world have done it. Well, then it's nothing. You'll be in and out. Oh, there you go. Oh, thanks, Brian. How do I look? Spot on. Great, great. Seems a bit funny putting a suit on without even going out for a meal, doesn't it? <laughs> it is, huh? Yeah. Hey, uh, are you sure you don't mind doing the babysitting? Oh, of course not. Pleasure, pal. Pleasure. Many thanks. Hey, yeah? it's a bit of a blow, all this. So, I mean, uh, what, what is it? And what's wrong with her? Well, it's a bit tricky to describe to the layman, Brian. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, it's, uh, w uh, I, yeah. You remember when we were kids, we used to get our sweets off that little woman who had the corner shop in Prosser Street? No. Yes, you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and, uh, uh, she used to have to go to the hospital every Friday morning. Yeah. An ambulance would come and pick her up. Do you remember? Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, do you remember that time in assembly when the music teacher took sick and she had to be helped out and she had to sit down in the headmaster's office till she felt better? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Right, well, it's a sort of mixture of those two. <laughs> Only, it's not as bad as what she had. The woman in chop. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. It. But, yeah. but, it's a bit worse than what she had in assembly. Yeah. That's yeah. the best way I can think of describing it, Brian. Yeah, yeah. If you've got a bit of paper, I'll do your drawing, yeah. if you like. No, 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 Trev, uh, you made it very clear. Yeah. Short of. Oh, hey, Trev. Yeah? Oh, yeah. I bought her these. Oh, that's yeah. very nice of you, Brian. Yeah. Uh, uh, I got to some as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's always been a certain sort of suppressed flamboyance about your character, hasn't there, Brian? <laughs> yeah. Myself, I, I, speaking personally, you understand, I've always preferred simplicity. You know, the classical line of the Greeks and so forth. Whereas you, uh, I imagine you see yourself as more of a, more of a Louis XV sort of a character. <laughs> you know, pinch of snuff and a powdered wig, lounging round in your palace at Versailles, a couple of cocker spaniels nipping your ankles, eh? Trev, Trev, look, it's, it's only a bunch of flowers. Yeah, of course it is. Sorry, boy. Mm. Would you like me to run my stethoscope over your vibrant little body? <laughs> Here we are. These are for you. Oh, Trevor. Oh. Mm. <sighs> These are from Brian. <laughs> I know. I know, but it's the thought that counts, isn't it? Freesias, they're my favourite. Oh, how sweet of him. 